Hey guys, how's everybody doing today? It's Maureen here. I hope you all are well. I am doing good. I am feeling great because I'm not sick like I was yesterday. Yesterday morning, I got up out of bed. I came downstairs. I felt fine when I got out of bed. I walked down my stairs into my living room and next thing I know, my body started like to feel like this I don't even know how to explain how I felt. It wasn't like an achiness or like a tense or it's so hard to explain. And then it was like a little bit of everything. Like when you feel sick, you know, like chills and the hot and cold. And, uh, and then I felt nauseous and I was just like, what is that? I got so nervous just because it hit me so quick. I had was just feeling fine. So I don't know. I have, must have had a touch of some sort of bug that's been going around or something. But I am so glad I feel better today. Oh, my gosh. I haven't felt like that in so long. So long. So And I was, like, sort of scared. I was like, maybe I need to go to the hospital. I don't know. I, yeah, that was, a, a yeah, a bit too much drama, you know. I should have, you know... I don't know. I just got so scared because <laughs> it hasn't happened to me in so long. So I was just like freaking out. Anyhow, so I have a short little haul for you guys. I didn't find, you know, I've been watching some hauls here, some of you ladies and gentlemen, and I'm not finding those things yet that I'm seeing, and I'm getting a little upset. I thought I was going to go to my Dollar Tree today, and I was going to hit the jackpot. Like, yes, yay, I found everything. But that wasn't the case. Anyhow, so I'm going to show you guys what I did find, and there may be a couple things in here. I think I got one or two new things like that. I really haven't seen anybody haul, but, you know, then again, I don't watch everybody. So let's get started. I will start with the food first. Um, first thing I want to show you guys are these vegetable and por pork pot stickers. And I just want to show you guys, I can't remember... I just hauled these not too long ago, but I want, we had these for dinner last, was it last night? Yes, last night, yeah, this is what I ate after feeling sick to my stomach until like three o'clock. Not the best thing, and dipping them in soy sauce with garlic. These were blazing. They were so good. If you guys see these, pick these up. They were so delicious. So grab those. Next thing I have were these Jenny O turkey burgers. Another thing, guys, you have to try these. These are so, so good, and they're so big. And I'm telling you, uh, these are good. These are uh, so much, I thought, better than the, the veggie burgers, everything. And this is one-third pound of a patty. So if you guys have these in your Dollar Tree, pick these up, I promise you will like them. If you like turkey burgers, they're very good. Next, I grabbed some, just some corn. I like these because they're steamables. You could do them right in the bag. Some broccoli cuts. I grabbed some of the mango chunks. Now, quick FYI for you guys. A lot of these um, fruits, they have like smoothie recipes on them. I haven't tried it with these mangoes. I haven't tried it with the peaches, but I did try it with the mixed berries. And I don't, I forgot another one that had, I think it was like strawberries and blueberries only or something like that. Anyhow, don't make a smoothie out of them because it's all seeds. Like I was sipping up, it was just a mouthful of seeds. So, I don't know. That's the only way I made them. I didn't put them over anything. I just stuck them right in the blender with some ice and a little bit of sugar and all that and milk and try to make a good smoothie. And I'm telling you, it was all seeds. So just want to give you guys a heads up on that. If you guys are planning on making smoothies with your mixed berries, anything with those little tiny seeds that are on like strawberries and stuff like that. Anyway, mango chunks. Those, I'm sure, you know, there's no seeds in those, so. And I've got these, guys. I've been getting these for quite a while. These are the Jimmy Dean griddle cakes, maple pancakes, and sausage. Now, I love these things, too. 
These are awesome. These are nice and easy, real quick in the morning. You're looking for a quick breakfast. Wrap a um, paper towel around them. Stick them in the microwave. I think it's for like a minute or two, whatever it is. Got to read the directions. But these are so good. So good. I love those. So I got those. I picked up some Jimmy Dean original sausage links. Grab those. And then I just got the Jimmy Dean sausage patties. For like Sunday mornings where we make our breakfast and stuff. I grab those to have with eggs and, you know, all the goodies, all the sides, you know, like hash browns and all that good stuff. Anyhow, I grabbed these. These are the good health. These are the veggie straws. And, but these are in the jalapeno. I, I haven't seen the jalapeno ones at my Dollar Tree. So I grabbed them. And these do have a little kick to them. So if you're not a big fan, I would pass on these and just get the regular ones. But this whole line, I think, is great. So I saw those and I just thought they were different. So I wanted to give them a try because I do like a little spice. So I grabbed those. Next thing I grabbed, I grabbed some more of these Havana cappuccinos. I grabbed four of these. And guys, these are so good. I think they're comparable to the um, the Starbucks, the cold ones, and um, like the frappuccinos and the cappuccino that they have in the, um, you know, the, your grocery stores and all that. But make sure it's just really cold, like really cold. It's so good. It really is. It tastes just as good as the Starbucks. Anyhow, I also got these. These are Lindsay. The name brand is Lindsay. And these are Spanish manzanella olives stuffed with um, pimento. So I grabbed those. This is a great name brand. So I got those. I also found this brand of kosher dill pickles. And these are called Supreme Star. Me and Savannah love dill pickles, and I did give these a try, and they are good. They are better than the Green Briar. Um, oh my gosh, I'm sitting out stripping. Um, the Green Briar ones that I've um, tried before, these are really good. So if you see those and you like dill pickles, those are good. I mean, believe me, I have had better dill pickles, but those are good for the dollar, and I mean, they really are tasty. So. Um, I also grabbed these, these California Healthy Harvest, and these are the Bartlett Pear Halves. I also have the um, pear, um, peaches that I, that comes in the same name brand and everything, which are very good, and I haven't tried the pears yet, but I'm sure they'll just be great. So, this is a nice big can. This is um, 29 ounces. This is a pound of pears here, so I thought that was a great find. Next thing I grabbed was this Arizona Arizona combo tray, nachos and cheese dip. Um, yeah, it has like the cheese and then, you know, the chips. I'm trying to remember. I think I've tried these a while back and I, I don't think I was a fan of them, but I'm not positive. So I said, well, let me pick them up and I'll try them again and see, you know. So we'll see what happens with that. Um, and I also found these. These are the, it says new. And these are Nestle's Raisinette Snack Mix. And this comes with shredded coconut, milk chocolate raisinets, peanuts, and I think that's it. And I found those. And, you know, I did get, what was the other one I got? I think it was the Nestle's Crunch. They must have ate it, I bet, because I can't find it anywhere. And I remember I did. I, I was looking for it before, and then I was like, no, maybe I didn't get it. But, no, I know I got it, so I think either Savannah or Louie must have made it but anyhow so i grabbed this and this was really good and this is a nice cool little snack if you're on the go and stuff a lot of um shredded coconuts in there so if you like coconut next thing i found was this simply this is by country kitchen and this is simply um made with whole grain soft oatmeal bread i found that and this says this goes for four dollars and 79 cents so this is no artificial preservatives 11 grams of whole grains per slice, 3 grams of fiber per slice, and 5 grams of protein per slice. That's awesome. So, yeah, so I grabbed this. This looks just so yummy. I can't wait to have a slice of that. So I got that. You guys know I always haul my Wonder Bread, but when I saw that, I was like, wow, that looks really good. Okay, and that's it for the food, guys, I believe. Yes, it is. So I found another one of these just floating around, the Bolero, the... um 
what is this one? Mango and orange blossoms. I found enough. I think I hauled one of these like last week or something. I just found like one package and one package again today. So I grab anytime I see those, I'll grab them. I got this um, pink Moscato candle. I hauled the. Oh, this smells so good. I hauled the dark, the purple ones um, last week, I believe. In those, I really like them. They gave off such a nice throw. So I'm hoping this one does too. This, this one really smells nice. I picked up some of these. And these are, it says, try it and love it. A dollar coupon is inside. And this is a always ultra thin. So it says size five. And um, yeah, there's three pads that come in here. So I said, you know what? I've never seen these at my Dollar Tree. They do have the always in a different packaging, and I believe it's like super or something. So I said, well, let me grab these and give these a try. If I like them, I'll buy the bigger ones at the um, the drugstore. So next thing I grabbed was my Pure Eyes. I always buy this. I'm always staying stocked on this because my eyes do get red very easily, and I just hate do not like when my eyes get red. And this stuff works awesome to keep the redness away. So I always have that. I carry that with me everywhere I go. And then I grab the um, the Olay Moisture Outlast, the Ultra Moisture with Shea Butter. I love this soap. And it only comes with one bar for a dollar, but that's okay. It works so, so good. It is so moisturizing. It says it's 10 times more moisturizing versus your regular soap. Um, so... I don't know. It, it works very well on my skin, and it really does moisturize very well. I grabbed some more of my Excedrin Migraine. Can't live without this. Always have to have that. I found this. This is a plaque. It says, Laugh. It will bring you joy. And this was the only style that I found there. And I didn't see anybody. I haven't seen these yet, personally. You guys may have. I haven't. But it has, like, the little thing on the back to, you know, if you want to hang it up. But I just thought that was so pretty. And I hope they do come out with other sayings. I'm hoping so. Normally they would, you know. But I just thought that was so nice. So I grabbed that. I grabbed some of the self-ink stamps. And this one says, be happy. Figured this would be cute for my mail. And then this one just has hearts on it. Got that. I got a couple of this Banaka because my breath cannot be singing when I'm cutting hair or when I'm talking to people. I just can't have that. <laughs> so, anyhow, I picked up this LA Colors. I got the trendy and I got the traditional. They look sort of alike, but I'm sorry about the glare, guys. But you know what, the LA Colors, if you haven't, they always have this at the Dollar Tree. And guys, I love makeup. I use, I don't know if you guys know, but people who are new to my channel, I am a barber. I'm a licensed cosmetologist. I did makeup up at the, um, our local mall for two and a half years. I love makeup. I love it. I love it. I love it. I have so much of it. <laughs> um, but yeah, I have high, I mean, I have, you know, name brands, you know, more of like the higher end things. I have things like this, this LA Colors. This is great. It has the pigmentation in it is awesome. It is so worth it. I mean, I love it. Of course, you're going to get fallout, but you get fallout even with, you know, the bigger name brands. So I don't want to hear anybody, oh, you know, LA. no, it's, you're going to get the same with all of it. The pigmentation is great. Next, I grabbed these, and I've never seen this kind in my Dollar Tree, and this is the Relia Shave, and this is four ward, superior four blade disposable razors, and it says new and improved for a closer, more comfortable shave. It has aloe vera strip and a pivoting head and comfort grip, so that comes with three. So I grabbed that. Normally, I get, I think it's like the six blade, and it come, those pink ones um, that come in the big pack, but I said, let me try these ones this time. So I got that. I got this gum brand Soft Picks, the original, for healthy gums, healthy life. And that comes with 10. So grab those. That's what you do with those on the back for you guys who don't know. Got that. I got a red and blue Sharpie. Great name brand. Grab those. I got a receipt book for work. Just because I do have some people who come in um, 
with who belong to I don't know how to say it, um, who have mental health issues and they live in a house that's not far away from my barbershop and I give them a discount but because they're all on fixed incomes a lot of the time like their social worker whoever brings them in always needs a receipt so I finally saw these at the Dollar Tree and I was like oh this is awesome because I pay a lot more for a receipt book um, at my supply company than a dollar that's for sure so I got those and then I found these nail arts and then I got that design I got this one so so pretty I thought that one and then I got that one and that's it for those and then last guys I just have some stickers here let me show you real quick I got these little monsters. They're too cute. Got those. I got the whales and the little fishies. I have these. These look like, um, these are just giraffes, elephants, more like a safari sort of animals you would see when you're on a safari. And these look flat, but they have a little texture to them, but they're beautiful. Oh, I love those. And then I found this one with the rainbow and... And I don't know, these are, they say they're stickers, but look at those big things in the back there. You have to like peel those off and then you use them. I just noticed that. But anyway, so it says they're just regular stickers. So I got those. Oh, geez. Everything's falling. Wait one second. <laughs> I'm a mess. Oh. Okay. Sorry, guys. Whew. Okay. So I got the ballerinas. So pretty, right? Oh, and the pretty ballerina shoes. And like I said, these are all like textured a little bit. Got those. And then I got the little fairies. So beautiful. And last, let me just show you guys these real quick. These are just letters. And I got one, two, three, four different styles. And they all, let me show you guys, because it's going on 17 minutes here for a small haul. I must have been talking a lot. I got those. I got those. And they are different um, patterns on them. So I just figured these would be great, you know, for packages, for whatever you want. So that's it, guys. That's all I have for you. I hope you guys saw something in this haul that you guys liked, that you want to put on your wish list maybe, or just maybe you learned like something new, like, hey, I never thought of getting that. Let me go get it, you know, because that happens to me a lot, too. Something I would never think of getting. And then I see somebody else. All, I'm like, hmm, I think I'm going to go get that. Anyhow, guys, I want you guys to take care wherever you are, whatever you're doing, day or night, night and day. You guys take care of yourselves, take care of each other, all that good stuff. And it was so nice being with you guys tonight. And take care. I hope to see you guys soon again. Bye, guys.